Hey everyone, welcome and thank you for joining us for another great video here on Chuck Wagon MTG. Today we're cracking open a bunch more packs of Theros Beyond Death uh, to finish up our patrons for the month. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, roll that other camera in here and get started. Who do we have first? We have MTG Hermit. Thank you so much for being a patron. It's greatly appreciated. Uh, MTG Hermit actually has a YouTube channel himself. Uh, go check it out if uh, uh, you are so inclined. Uh, it, it's been it's been a couple months since he's uploaded stuff, but um, still some good stuff on there. Uh, he actually uh, the one of the last videos he posted was uh, Avison Restored Packs, I believe it was. Pretty cool opening. Pretty cool opening. Lots of foils. Lots of foils. But anyways, MTG Hermit. This is what you're getting. He gets, uh, this is for 10 bucks a month. Well, by the way, if you're interested in checking out our Patreon, how to get into it, what we have, what we offer, uh, description down below. There's a link. Follow it. You'll find it. This right here is 10 bucks. He gets two packs of the current standard, and then we build him a pack out of the build a pack box. But our packs have two rares, not just one. That's what these are. Common or uncommon worth at least a buck. We got a random foil. We got to refill the common or uncommons. Uh, we got a random foil basic, and then 10 cards from here. These are just uh, cards from throughout Magic's history. Uh, no real rhyme or reason to them, aside from the fact that uh, they're generally not worth a whole lot of money. One, two, three, four, five. Um, like I said, it's mainly commons and uncommons, but there are a few rares seated in here and there, as well as some extra foils. And there's prize cards where you can rent, win extra packs and... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One more. Uh, you can win extra rares, extra pulls, just all sorts of good stuff. So there we are. All right, let's see what we got for MTG Hermit. Uh, let's see. You got a uh, Lazatop, Lazatop Behemoth, a Brindle Boar, Knight of Sorrows. Uh, we got a. See, now these older cards are harder, harder for me to read in this light. Uh, Sultari Trooper. That's what that is. Uh, we've got a blood-soaked altar, uh, star-crowned stag, we got a Vernati shield mate, we got an inspiring unicorn, mind rot, and then salvager of secrets. All right, let's see what you got for your foil basic. It is a uh, Throne of Eldraine Mountain. Nice, pretty shiny that my camera does no justice to. Your random foil is... Oh, you got a uh, foil rare. You got a uh, magma giant. Look at that. Party. All right. Common or uncommon. Uh, you got gifted aetherborn. Um, I believe this is still over a buck. If it's not, we'll replace it, but I think it still is. Your first rare is stolen by the Fae. Followed up by winner, winner, chicken dinner. Uh, you got the promo pack, Garrick, Cursed Huntsman. Not bad on that right there. All right. Good deal. Let's see what you got in your packs. Okay. We got that. That should be land. That should be rare. That should be that. And that is that. Okay. Uh, let's see here. We got Staggering Insight. Uh, hey, Gary! And then Glimpse of Freedom. And then your rare is the first Iroan Games. Um, so when this card first came out, I was not a fan. Um, it's starting to grow on me a bit more. I still don't think it's great, but if you're playing a heavy enchantment deck, it it, it can work out. It can work out. So, all right. I'm having severe difficulties opening this pack. What, what did I? There we go. <laughs> all right. Token land rare. Okay. And let's see. We got what we got here. We got a fairies band brawler, uh, dream stealer, or sorry, dream stalker, manticore. And then Fanalax Tactics. With your second rare being... Ooh, Eat from Extinction. Um, I'm really starting to like this card more and more. This card, that's winner-winner right there. That's good stuff. 
All right. Well, congratulations. Uh, your uh, packs weren't that bad, but the build a pack boxes, I think, where you won here. That's some good stuff. All right. So we'll take these. We'll put your name tag on it. Put that right there. And we move on to our next, which is Mr. Kevin Wheeler. Kevin, thank you so much for being a patron. It is greatly appreciated. Kevin gets the same thing, two packs. All right, and then we got one rare. We got, we'll grab the very last one, two. Common or uncommon, very first random foil and very first random foil basic. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, let's see what we can pull for Kevin. Hopefully it's a prize card because we still, it's been like a month and a half, two months since we saw a prize card. But, oh, well, you got a, a bonus rare right off the bat, Zahid, Jin of the Lamp. Uh, we got Sanitarium Skeleton, we got Once in Future, Overcome, Piston Fist Cyclops, I, Pauper, I just love that thing, uh, Thirst for Meaning, we got a Suntail Hawk, uh, Ethereal Ambush, Eternal Isolation, and Uncaged Fury. Alright, not too shabby, let's see what you got for your foil basic, it is a Magic Fest Forest. Not a bad hit. Thank you so much uh, to the, the wonderful fan of the show that sent us some of these lands to give away. That, that was awesome. Your random foil is a Kozlik Sentinel. Let's see what you got for a random common or uncommon. You got Light Up the Stage. Once again, I'm pretty sure it's over a buck, but if it's not, we'll replace it. Uh, first rare is Kaya's Guile. That's not bad, not bad. Followed up by Deep Forest Hermit. All right. Congrats on the Build the Pack pack. Let's go ahead and see what you have in your packs. Hopefully it's something good. I love pulling good stuff for the patrons. Oh, that means there's a foil. All right, what do we got here? We got uh, Calafi, Beloved of the Sea. We got Impending Doom, and we got Sea Gods Scorn. See, your rare is, your rare is... Ooh, Setsian Champion. Okay, that's not a bad card. I, I'm kind of digging that. Your foil is... Oh, you... <laughs> foil Underworld Breach. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Congrats, Kevin. Congrats. Oh, man. We are just knocking them out of the park for the patrons. I love this. Love it. Wait, is it no? Land? Land? Yeah. And then that should be... Okay. No. There we go. I don't know what happened there. All right. We got a Nessian Horn Beetle. We've got Entrancing Liar, and we've got The Birth of Miletus, or Miletus. I don't know how it's pronounced. But then your rare is... You got a Timoret, Timoret Call of the Dead. No, Calls the Dead. I knew what that said. Let's make sure you're paying attention. Good job, peoples. All right. Well, congratulations, Kevin. Those are not some bad pulls. Not bad pulls at all. All right, then who do we have up next after that? We have MTG Unpacked. Thank you so much for being a patron, uh, especially considering that he also has a, a, a YouTube channel that's um, quite a bit bigger than ours. <laughs> um, if you get a chance, go check them out. If you haven't already, uh, they opened you up just a ton of stuff around there. So good stuff. Go check them out. MTG Unpacked. Let's see, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, 
let's see what we got for MTG Unpacked. All right, we've got a Wailing Ghoul. Moreland Inquisitor. We got an Advocate of the Beast. Carrion Imp. Raise the Alarm. Uh, Bleak Coven Vampires. We got a Scuttle Mutt. Claim the Firstborn. Love that card. We've got a deck tech that runs this. That, oh, Goblin Adoption Agency. That was so fun. Uh, we've got Cemetery Recruitment. And we've got a Steel Clad Serpent. Alrighty. Let's see what you got here. Your foil basic is... You got yourself a Full Art Foil Swamp from Battle for Zendikar. Followed by a... A foil rare, uh, cruel ultimatum. All right, common or uncommon is mystical dispute. I'm knocking them out of the park today. First rare, living twister. Okay, well that's a little okay. <laughs> that, that got us back on track. That's all. It just kind of even keel. That's all I did. Second rare, bone crusher giant. I'll tell you that. I'm really digging that card. All right, well, congrats on your packs, or your Build-A-Pack box pack. Let's go ahead and see what you have in your regular packs. All right, what do we got? We got a Warden of the Chained, uh, Scaphos Maze Warden, and then Sage of Mysteries, followed by Artis, or Atris, Oracle of Half-Truths. I'm digging this card as well. Um, I like it. I like it. And especially on Arena, I think there are some people that don't under... Either they either don't understand how to execute um, their decision uh, in Magic Arena. Uh, because there's a lot of times that they simply give me all the cards. And I guess if... If I'm playing a, a deck that they can obviously see that I'm using um, Escape, then I can see possibly doing that. But there have been times uh, where, you know, I've, st I've got, already got, you know, 20 cards in the graveyard, and then I play this, and they still all go to my hand. You know, at 20 cards in the graveyard, it doesn't matter. I can exile whatever I want. So, anywho, let's go ahead and continue this instead of having me babble. Uh, one, two, three, and then... Oh, that means we did get a foil. All righty. All right, what do we got? We got a chain web, web arachnir. We got a stinging lion, lionfish and an underworld fires. Your second rare is Nadir Kraken. Love this card. Um, I actually built a deck just kind of to mess around. That runs this. That's just it's, it's essentially this in quasi duplicate and spark double, and it's just all sorts of great. All right, and then your foil is a foils hydra's growth. That's good stuff right there. That's good stuff. All right. Well, congrats on the packs. Go ahead and grab the main tag here. Put you in the stack. All right, who do we have up next? Next we have Mr. Richard Bullwin. Richard, thank you so much for being a patron. Greatly appreciate it. We got one, two, three, four, and number five. We're gonna go in the middle for that one. And then we got one, two, three, four. Nope, oh, if I can grab some, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, let's see what we got for Richard. Um, which, Richard, you know what? I'm trying to think back. Let me know, did I send you a signed card? Because everyone, their first month of getting cards, they get a signed and possibly altered card by moi. Um... And I don't remember if I sent you one, so let me know. We got a Primordial Worm. We got a Mark of the Vampire. Goblin Gavalier. Leaf Kin Druid. We got a Pitiless Gorgon. Ooh, uh, Wisp, Whip Tongue Frog. Uh, we got a Midnight Guard. We got a Shining Armor. 
Eager Construct, and Right Claw Gargantuan. All right, let's see what you got here. Your foil basic is an M19 Forest, followed up by a foil duress from M14. Your common or uncommon is another mystical dispute. This card is just this nutso. Nutso. All right, your first rare is uh, Methidius. No, Mephidros Vampire. Mephidros? Mephidros. We'll call him Meeps. All right, your second rare is... Oh, Mass Calcify. Okay, that's not bad. All right, let's see what you got in your packs. Um, I don't think the Build a Pack Box... Build a Pack Box pack was too bad. Although I do believe the Mystical Dispute was the best card in it. I could be wrong, but I don't think I am. All right. Oh, but we did get a foil in your first pack. All right. We got Triumph of the Annex. We got uh, Clothy's Design. Yeah. We got Agonizing Remorse. Your first rare is... Oh, Dream Trawler. So gross. Such a busted card. All right, and your foil is, hey, look at that. You get a foil constellation, oop, back in center, uh, Timoret, chosen from death. That's awesome. That is a good pull. All right, pack number two. I think we're doing pretty good, but let's see if we can't do a bit better. Okay. Uh, Dreamstalker, Man Manticore, Chainweb, Arachnir, and Inevitable End. Alright, your second rare is... Storm Herald. Uh, I actually haven't even really played with this. Oh, I, okay, I have seen it played. I'm not sure what I think about it, but still, not bad. Not bad. Alright, well, congratulations. We'll go ahead and take these cards and put them right here. We're going to grab your name tag... This stuff is falling all over because it's an absolute disaster area. Alright, who do we have up next? We have Twilight Eve. Twilight, thank you so much for being a patron. It's greatly appreciated. We're going to grab two packs. This is a very popular tier, by the way. Uh, the $10 tier is the... The most popular, uh, but this coming month is going to be the last month that you can actually get the $10 tier. After that, um, we unfortunately do have to raise our prices. It's uh, Our prices are not going up by much. We're essentially just trying to offset uh, the shipping difference from when we started and the uh, uh, help offset the price of booster boxes from when we started. So, all right, we got one, five, six, seven... 8, 9, and 10. All righty. Let's see what we got for Twilight out of this wonderful stuff. We have got a Parhelion Patrol. We got an Embrath Paladin. Generous Stray. We got Ethereal Ambush. I, lo I love Manifest. I just I was a big fan of that. We got a Frost Lynx. We got a Passwall Adept. We got a Soul's Grace, uh, Quicksilver Geyser, ooh, you got a Soul Link, and a Frilled Sea Serpent. All right. Foil Basic is, ooh, an M11 Forest. Nice. Followed up by a, ooh, Foil Rise to Glory. That's not bad. That's a fun card. All right, Common Run Common, you got an Unclaimed Territory. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's still over a buck. Uh, what do we got here? We've got a Quicken from M14. Your second rare is... Boom! A Phoenix of Ash. That one, I think, is underappreciated right now. Uh, for, for standard. For standard. Um, I'm not sure how I feel about it uh, in other formats. I think we've got better, better options, but... All right, well, hopefully you get something good in your packs. 
All right, no foil. Uh, we got a, a Utropia, the twice favored. Uh, and this card is just in limited, is bonkers. Uh, we got another Maze Warden and a Glimpse of Freedom. With your rare being a Lure of the Unknown. Okay, I want to know how you all feel about this card because I just... Anytime I run this scenario through my mind, it's always worst case scenario, you know, and it just, it seems really good, but it seems like there's just too big of a drawback. I don't know. I want to know your thoughts on this card. All right, got that. One, two, three. There's a foil. All right. All right. Uh, Calfi, beloved by the sea, uh, the constellation version. We got uh, The Birth of Miletus and Soul Guide Lantern. Why did I put those on there upside down? I don't know. I don't know why I do the things I do. <sighs> Alright, so your first or your second rare is Nylia's Intervention. I actually just put a copy of this in my Milo Green EDH. I'm digging it. With your foil being. A foil ordeal of mountains blaze all right good stuff well congratulations thank you for being a patron let me get your name tag here if I can find it underneath all the wrappers I promise next month we're not gonna cram everybody into two videos we just did it this month essentially to um, so we could open Theros for you guys <laughs> all right who do we have next next up we have Cody Harak. Cody, thank you so much for being attention. It is greatly appreciated. He is in our booster uh, booster pack here, the booster pack club. So he gets a pack and then a random foil basic. Let's see what he got for his foil basic. It is a Throne of Eldraine Mountain. Let's go ahead and see what he got in his pack. Do -do -do. No foil. All right. We got Triumph of Annex. We got Nessian Horn Beetle and Agonizing Remorse. Followed by... Ooh. Afima the C Cacophony. Yeah, Cacophony. This card is gross. Um, I didn't think much of it. Just I mean, it's a 2-1 with flying. Eh. But this can get out of hand quick. Especially if, if you have multiple copies. That's good stuff. All right, well, I'm going to take your card, slip it in here. Do that. All right, who do we have next? We have, oh, our next is our oldest patron, Mr. Kevin Chang. Kevin, thank you so much for being a patron and being there for quite some time now. Um, we're going to grab this land and this pack. Let's see what you got for your basic. You got a Kevin in the Lands every time. Uh, he got a full art mountain, foil mountain, uh, from the new set. Let's go ahead and see what, oh, what he's got in his pack. No foil. All right. Let's see. We got an enchanting or entrancing liar. We got Sea God Scorn and the Binding of the Titans. With his rare being Nyx Bloom Ancient Union. Lucky Dog. This is honestly the only card that I really wanted to pull from the set. Um, I don't think it'll be good even in EDH because this right here is going to be an instant target. Um, that being said, I am still putting it in my mono EDH, but. Anyways, congratulations on yet another great hit. Go ahead and put your name tag on it. Man, congrats. All right, now what do we have up next? Uh, well, I got to open this program before I do anything else because I forgot to do that. I occasionally uh, do that, forget things, but... Anywho, all right, let's get this other thing fired up. Uh, nope, 
I clicked the wrong button. There we go. Now we're thinking with power. I'm sorry, folks. Anyway, so we're going to go over here. We've got uh, Wheel Decide, my favorite site. Um, I just, I absolutely love this. If you commented on one of last week's videos, uh, we're going to go ahead and we put your name here on the wheel. We're going to run over to random.org. We're going to roll two six-sided dice, whatever comes up. That's how many times we're going to spin the wheel. We got three. I'll go ahead and do that. Good luck to everybody that's involved. We got once, twice, and thrice. Congratulations to Ulysses. Congratulations. You won again. This is at, at least two or three times that you've won. That's, but I want to say it's more. All right. Let me write your name down. Okay, now something to keep in mind to get your packs to win any of this stuff. Two things has to happen. First, you have to be subscribed to the channel, and you do have to contact us, anyone who wins, through any of the social medias to tell us where to send it. If you don't contact us and collect it within 30 days, then the prize is forfeited and it goes into the Patreon Build a Pack box. But we are not done. We're going to go down here, and we are going to find Ulysses' name. We're going to update the wheel changes. We're going to go and roll some dice again. This time we got eight. We're going to click this thing eight times, and then whoever comes up, you're going to win a pack. Good luck to everyone that's involved. We got once, twice, thrice, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Congratulations to Joel Sudnohofsky, who is actually a patron of ours. Um, and actually, I haven't sent out cards um, from the previous video, so I will go ahead and just throw this in uh, with this month's cards. Um, and don't forget, if you want to get in on any of these contests we have, like this one right here, all you got to do is comment on the video and be subscribed. I mean, that's it. That is it. All right. Well, let's go ahead and see. We're going to do Ulysses pack first. I should probably switch screens here. That's probably a good idea. Um, doo -doo -doo. All right. Let's see what we got in his pack. No foil. Let's see, there's an Acolyte of Affliction, Whirlwind Denial, and Hero of the Winds. With his rare being, Perforos, Perforosis, Perforosis, Intervention. Finally got it out. Holy cats, that was painful. All right, well, congratulations. We'll go ahead and do that for you. We'll do that. All right, now on to Joel's pack. Let's see what we can add to his goodie pack or goodie, goodie package this month. There is a foil. All right, we got a Blood Aspirant. We got a Shimmerwing Chimera and a Mirror Shield. With your rare being... Uh, Taranika Akron Veteran I think that's how it's pronounced with your foil being a foil temple of malice good stuff right there congratulations Joel you deserve it alright well that about wraps things up um, I want to thank everyone uh, for joining us here today and participating in everything um, quick just kind of update announcement um we are going to have um a regular uh streaming date uh up um we're just not sure what day of the week it's gonna be but we are gonna pick a day to stream um we're just we're essentially waiting for my wife's work schedule to settle down a little bit so we can kind of figure it out a little better um and aside from that um 
uh, yeah, I think that's it. Um, if you like what you saw here today, do us a huge favor. Click the like button, hit subscribe, hit the bell notification button so you can tell we have new stuff coming out. And then don't forget to share this with your friends, your family, your loved ones, and your pets. Everyone could use a little more magic in their lives. Thank you very much for watching. As always, you can find us on all the social medias, Chuckwagon MTG.